Rock and dust samples brought back from the near-Earth asteroid Bennu contain organic matter, including amino acids and all five DNA and RNA bases, as well as salts that formed early in the history of Bennu's parent body, according to a pair of studies by international and Australian researchers. In 2018, the OSIRIS-REx mission collected samples from Bennu, the first study by international authors, analysed the samples to reveal thousands of organic molecular, uh, molecular compounds, including 14 of the 20 amino acids present in life on Earth, 19 non-protein amino acids, rare or absent in known biology, and all five DNA and RNA bases. Bennu was also found to be rich in nitrogen and ammonia, which formed billions of years ago in cold, distant regions of our solar system. In the second study, international and Australian scientists found salts, which the team says may have formed during the evaporation of brine on Bennu's parent body, indicating that water was present there. The potential presence of water together with nuclear nucleobases raises questions about the process that creates the building blocks for life, they say. In conclusion, the authors uh, say Bennu has a much richer complexity in organic matter than here on Earth and suggest that its parent body may have come from the outer solar system. I'll chat with NASA's lead scientist, Jason Dworkin, on this week's Deep Dive. Well, daily science and space stories with an Aussie flair, plus a deep dive into the science and space headline of the week and the occasional science fiction podcast. Like, follow and subscribe for more. Membership available to help us do more. The trek.zone slash support. This is Trek Science. Talking Science. 